everyone doing today? I hope you are all doing well. I am filming this on Thursday. Yeah, today is Thursday. <laughs> Guys, it's been a while. The last video that I did, I believe, was the Friday before Easter. So it's been a minute. Life has been busy and there's been like so much going on and it's like literally i swear i wake up i work i blink and it's 10 o'clock at night already it's like the days are going by so fast and so right now we have um our dog had puppies so we have four puppies um and it's been a lot of work you know cleaning up after the dogs the puppies are like just now learning they're about seven seven or eight weeks old so I have two that are already claimed and then I have two more that I have to find owners for. So yeah, that's kind of been what's been going on here. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. But today I have for you guys a Dollar Tree haul. Because you know, that's what we do here. We do Dollar Tree, we do bargain stores, everything and anything. <laughs> but anyway let me show you guys so first did i need this absolutely not i have so much tupperware and stuff but what i did do is a few weeks ago i cleaned out all the old ones threw them away like whichever ones were stained or had a little crack or i couldn't find the lid for so i did i don't have anything this size in my defense but guys look at this color and the design let's take this off it's from sure fresh three containers and they're oh my goodness they feel like good plastic if you know you know because sometimes the sure fresh containers don't like the plastic feels very cheap like if you press it too hard or you put your nail into it you know like it cracks but this one, no, it's good. And let's see. How cute is this? A little fruit salad, um, jello, uh, rice pudding. Like, you know, when you make things like that and you need little containers to put them at lunch, they're just so cute. And they did have them in different colors. Um, I believe there was like a blue, a green, and then the pink. And of course, I grabbed the pink. But I honestly really like the quality of the plastics. I think I might go back and get some more. Let's see if they still have them. But yes, and that was the label. So we got that. Oh my goodness, you guys. I never really buy bags unless it's for Christmas, like, you know, gift bags and stuff. But I found the cutest bags and I had to grab them. I had to. So I'm planning on using these for Mother's Day. There was a sale on Easter for Bath and Body Works. They had their three wick candles uh, for, I believe it was $10. So I ordered a couple of those to, you know, to kind of build up Mother's Day gifts, if that makes sense. And I saw these and I thought that these were so adorable, you guys. Look at this. This is a gift bag, and look how nicely made they are. I said to myself, these are gonna fly, so you better grab them now. So go to your Dollar Tree and look for these because they are gorgeous. Hold on, because there's more. There's more. <laughs> Let me show ya. So they have four different styles. Guys, guys. They're so cute. I just can't. I want to like display them. Idea. Idea. So you can make this into like a vase, for example, or, like a bag full of flowers. So you can put a piece of styrofoam in here, um, stick your flowers in there, like a little display for a centerpiece for like a bridal shower. That's a nice idea. Or if you want to put it put it out in your house for like the summertime for spring. But see the handles are in here. It's like just so well made. I was so surprised to find these. And then the front has glitter. The back doesn't. It's like flat. But how cute. And then this one. This one doesn't have glitter at all. 
Okay, so we got those. <clears throat> then we got this one. See, they're all different. So I got one for my mom, one for my grandmother, one for my daughter, Brianna, because she's the one that has the baby. She's a mom. And I got an extra one just because they had four different ones. But let me show you guys. This one, the ribbon for the handle is pink. It's like a hot pink. How cute. What? Okay, and then the last, I left the last one. for. I left the best one last. This one is my favorite one. Let me open it up before I show you guys because it's that good. It's that good. Purple handle. Guys, what? It's so cute. Look at this. I love it. And that's what the bottom looks like. And they are by um, Viola. I don't know how to say that, but there you go. It's that party brand that we always see in uh, the Dollar Tree, but. Guys, these are just so cute. Let me know in the comments if you guys find these cute because I just about died when I found them. I was like, oh my goodness, they are so cute. And maybe they've made them in the past years and I've never seen them or noticed them before. So you do have to put the little piece of cardboard to the side so that it closes properly so that you can put it away. See? <clears throat> Okay, sorry guys, I know I'm taking long. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You guys know, if you've been watching, you know I always drop something. Always. It never fails. Never fails. <laughs> I'm getting stuck here. Okay, I'm getting there. <coughs> Excuse me guys, okay. Then I found these three bags and I just had to get them. So this one says mom, so cute. And it's like the color, like, okay, so the camera's not doing it justice. The color is like a very light lavender, almost like a gray lavender. I love that color. Then you have like that mint green and it says mom and it's so cute. So this one, the front has foil, the back doesn't. And it's of course the same brand as the little purses. And then I just, this is like, these colors, I, I've been drawn to these colors, like this whole aesthetic. So this says always and forever. So obviously this could be a bag for like a wedding, uh, an engagement party, you know, something like that. Look at that green. And then the side of the bag is like this. So I do have my cousin's wedding coming up at the end of this month. I mean, usually for weddings, you give, um, you know, money as the gift. However, I am going to, um, I don't know, I want to, she is my youngest cousin, and she's like, sorry guys, my alarm went off. Um, anyway, so I have my youngest cousin's wedding at the end of this month, and um, I wanted to do something special or get her something special, um, you know, for her wedding. They're having like a welcome dinner on a Friday. So we're staying at a hotel. We go Friday, we drive down. It's a welcome dinner Friday night. And then we sleep at the hotel Friday. Then Saturday, we have a wedding. We stay at the hotel Saturday and we check out Sunday. Therefore, I um, wanted to get her something sweet and special. Um, she's been such a great mentor to my oldest daughter in terms of school and career and all of that. And she's just, she holds a special place in my heart. She's the greatest. She really is. Um, well, anyway, this bag says cheers to life together. So I just thought that these, like, it kind of matches her aesthetic. So my mom, so this is my dad's side of the family. However, my mom and my aunt, my dad's youngest sister, whom is my youngest cousin's mother, get along very well. They were friends before my mom even met my dad. Like, my mom met my dad through my aunt. So, there you go, a little backstory. Um, but anyway, they um, get along really well. So, my mom is helping them make the centerpieces. Well, she made the centerpieces, basically, for the wedding. And it kind of has these colors. So, I thought that these bags were perfect. To give her like a little gift or something. I don't know yet what I'm going to do. But I have to hurry up because it's at the end of this month. Seriously. Okay you guys. 
we all know the Dollar Tree is where you go for socks, right? Right. <laughs> well, I found some socks that I had been looking for that I had not found previously. And I am trying to get everything together to show you guys. Okay, here we go. So these are just like your basic juncture socks for men. I got a pack, I got two of each. One for my hubby, one for my son, because these are great for the spring and summertime for their sneakers and stuff. And they have all the basic colors here that they need. You guys have seen those. Now, the little socks that have been going around like this one, I've already hauled, but it's Ninja Turtles. How am I not gonna get it again? So I got that one. My son loves Kool-Aid and cherries, like one of his favorite flavors, well, fruit punch for Kool-Aid. He loves Swedish fish. This one is for my daughter, Brianna, because she loves hot Cheetos. <laughs> so I gotta set that one to the side. And my son loves Lay's chips. This is my son. Like, this describes my son right here. We're just missing a game controller, mac and cheese, and a pizza. And you have Jaden. Oh, and chicken nuggets. And you have Jaden. <laughs> So yes, yeah, so I got those for him. He already saw them and he loved them. He started laughing when I showed them to him. Now you guys, these are like for the Mother's Day collection and they are so soft and so cute. So they're low cut, fuzzy socks. They're super soft inside, okay? This one has a little teddy bear and it says mama bear. So I thought that this would be cute for Brianna, like to add to her little gift. Um, and it has like the little rubber things so you don't slip. And I got myself a pair of the same ones. And then I got these for my mom. It says best mom ever. And I thought that these were super cute to add to her gift. So got that. This here. Oh, I guess I got an extra one. I think for my grandmother. I don't remember, but I got an extra one. So there's that. Um, okay, I got a couple of Wet n Wild makeup brushes because their brushes are really good, you guys. Um, this is the small eyeshadow brush. I've hauled this before, so I got two of these because I love using this for crease and I love using it for eyeshadow as well, so got that. And then these are the crease brush. I got two of these as well. You can find these at the stores for a lot more than $1.25, so you can see. I mean, it even has a little thing for your finger. It has some weight to it. It's easy to get into your crease and kind of do the little, you know? So, got that. Then, I found, I'm trying to like stay within the um, section of the store, if that makes sense. Um, let's see. So we're doing beauty right now. I was very, very surprised, you guys. Very surprised. So we know I only for the lashes. So my daughter Brianna loves lashes. She's she wants to learn how to do them professionally. So, but for now, like these are so beautiful, and I want her to put these on me because I can't put lashes on myself. I don't know why, but I can't. And the, so these are called Wispy Full Medium Cat Eye. How cute are those? Then this one, Wispy Full Medium Cat Eye. Yeah, I got a couple of the ones that I liked. Wispy Full Dreamy Doll. Look at these, you guys. How beautiful. They are so cute. And the packaging. So Wispy Full Dreamy Doll. I think I got like two or three of each. Wispy Full Dreamy Doll. Because this was one of my favorite ones. And then this one is called Natural Light Doll. But how cute. They are adorable. Adorable. Okay. I, I picked up a couple of their new products. This one is called the Shea Butter Lipstick Route 66 or Route 66. I had already opened this because I was dying to see like what the color looked like. First of all, you guys, it's a heart. Like, how cute, how cute. Let's put it on top of my lip gloss. Oh. 
it gives you a nice oh i like that with the brown oh guys in the 90s that's what i wore but look when you get a lipstick color that you don't like you guys don't throw it away put one on that you do like add a little bit of the one that you don't like and make your own color and play around with it i've seen so many makeup artists like do that um in tiktoks and stuff like they get this beautiful luscious like lips and it's like the colors that you're mixing and putting together it's crazy if you see like how they actually like got to that point to get to achieve that color it's just so cool so cool okay then they had from its fat chubby stick and it's uh, alabaster gold it's a primer highlighter eyeliner eyeshadow and long lasting so i guess you can use it maybe as an eyeshadow primer so let's see i don't know this one I haven't played around with yet. I had only opened the lipstick one and I was dying to play with these. Okay, so it is like a pencil. Oh, it's a pretty highlighter. So let's see. Right on the nose. Don't mind my <laughs> broken nail. Put right here. It's pretty. It's very pretty. I don't know if you guys can see that there, but it's beautiful. You can also come in here and like do a little highlight. See that? And kind of blend it in, even on your eyelid. If you don't know how to do eyeshadow or you feel a little self-conscious about eyeshadow, you can, for example, grab your bronzer, grab a brush like this, Apply a little bit of bronzer, okay? Just a little bit, you don't have to go all out and crazy. Take this and go right over your eyelid and then just take your brush and blend it. And there you go, one, two, three. Just a little tip, because I know eyeshadow can be a little bit um, overwhelming for some people. This is liquid blush. I was like, what? Liquid blush? And it's the color orange glow. I don't know if they had any other colors. This was the only one I found. Same with the chubby stick. This is what it looks like. It looks like the one that I have from e.l.f. Ooh. Okay, it is messy, guys. So just be careful. If you do get this, let's blend. Ooh, that's pretty. That's gonna be a really pretty blush, guys. And look how well it blends. Ooh, for the summer, heck yeah. That's a gorgeous color. And for a buck 25. And then this, I've never seen, never. Finishing Glow Spray. Lightweight Misting Flor Flora <laughs> Formula. Lock in your flawless makeup for face and body. And it is in the color gold, or it says gold gold ore i don't know but let's see it looks like a oh no wait hold on hold on it's not just a finishing spray you guys oh, this is so cute some is spilling oh it's raining really hard outside look i don't know if you guys can see it looks like magic let's spray my arm or my hand Oh, you get like, okay, can you, t well, you're not going to be able to tell the difference. Oh, hold on. And it smells nice. Can you guys see, like, I know right now it looks wet, but it dries and you get almost like glittery sparkle. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness. For the summertime, you guys. Wow, I only... All right, I see you, Ioni. They're doing their thing. Um, so it says, spray to lock in your flawless makeup all day long. This spray delivers a cooling lightweight mist, refreshing your makeup to keep it in place for hours without creasing or fading. Shake well before use. Okay. Okay, staying within that section, we have a couple of more things. 
Oh, more lashes. This one is Natural Light Wispy. Okay, and hold on. You guys are going to come with me because I am baking a banana bread. And I have it in the oven. And I need to make sure that it is okay because I might have to take it out already. Sorry, guys. Oh, yeah. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I can't wait to show you guys. I don't know. Um, I use my phone, right, to film these videos. And I know that some people, and I'm so sorry that I'm moving you guys around so much, but I know that some people, they actually have like an app that they use so that they can film and kind of flip their camera if they needed to. But I don't know if it's only for Android. I have to look into that. I hope it didn't burn. It looks kind of dark, you guys. I almost forgot about it. Let me see if I could show you guys. Hold on. Can you guys see it there? There you go. That's my banana bread. It looks so yummy. Let's try a little piece from the top. Mmm. Perfection. Mm. I didn't break that from scratch, by the way. I actually... Um went to the supermarket just for garlic bread because i made pasta for dinner tonight but of course i picked up a whole bunch of other things that we didn't need they had by the cookie section like where the refrigerated cookie section like the cookie dough they had from phil's berry it was like a big thing like this and it said banana bread and all you had to do was squeeze the dough out of the package onto a baking pan and throw it in the oven and i said sign me up because i love banana bread <laughs> okay sorry guys sorry 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 back to business we're getting there see okay we're almost there. Okay, I've hauled these before. That was my drop. <laughs> Remember, I always drop something. I've hauled these before, but they've always had them in like that maroon, purpley color, um, like darker colors, I guess. It was like a, a mauve type of feel with the colors or vibe. I don't know, guys, I can't talk anymore today. <laughs> But anyway, they had them now in mint, purple, and pink. And guys, this is what I use to do my eyebrows. My husband uses these to give himself, like, like to shape up his beard when he's gonna shape, like, clean up my son's haircut in between going to the barber shop and stuff. He uses these, so we go through these a lot. So I picked up a couple of these. I'm sure that they work the same. It's just a different color, but that was nice to see. Then I found from Global Beauty, Fresh and Fruity, Coconut Sugar and Lactic Acid Moisturizing Cleansing Wipes. So I picked up two packs of these. I'll be honest, I, I opened one up and it doesn't really smell like coconut to me. I don't know. You guys let me know, have you tried these? Do they smell like coconut to you? Because to me it really didn't. But that's that. Then... Let me show you guys these last things. No, this is the Wispy Full Dreamy Doll Lashes from Myoni. And the Wispy Full Medium Cat Eye. I believe I showed these already, but I had more, you know? Then they had, I got this mascara from Myoni thinking it was black mascara. But no, it is actually blue, right? It says it down here. It's blue mascara. So got that. Then, of course, you guys know the clips, but look at these, guys. How could I have said no to these? How cute. Look at those colors. It's white, gray, like an orangey, brownish, and a purple. Then they had this vibe, and it's different. So they have, it's like a different shape. And then... Like, if you have a little girl, oh my god, this would be so cute in their hair. 
I probably will use these like maybe if I'm gonna clip each side, you know, like something like that, but I couldn't pass up on these. They were too cute. Too cute for words. Okay, then the infused moisturizing gloves. I opened these up already. Um, the smell is amazing. It smells like eucalyptus uh, and mint and stuff. But I don't know. I I okay. So I thought that these gloves were going to be like moisturizing, like you know, the glove masks that they sell, and they also have like for the feet. Like I thought I was gonna feel like cream or something on here, and I don't. I don't know what I'm supposed to feel, <laughs> but it does smell really good. So I got that. Maybe like on a night that I take a bath, um, do like a face mask and stuff and put on these gloves, kind of treat myself. I may use that for that. Then I got the microfiber hair wrap. These are good for like when you come out of the shower and your hair is wet and you just want to like tie it up to get it out of the way if you have to run around and do things. Um, I don't know how um, absorbing this will be because I think it is a little thin. Let's see. Yeah, it is a little bit on the thin side, but I'm going to give it a try and see if I like it. I thought it was cute. I am using currently the um, towel scrunchies. Oh my God, those are so good, you guys. You just tie your hair up after you shower and it helps make your hair dry quicker. Okay, then I found the scalp massager. This one is lavender. I also got the rose one. That one is already in my room, but I wanted to get the lavender one to see how it smells. Ah. Oh yeah, yeah, my nails. Okay. Ooh, wow, that's a strong lavender scent, but you can kind of get the point, you know, you massage your scalp with this. Imagine being in the shower and just, oh, I can't wait to use mine. But yes, I got that. Then, for my grandson, he loves Spider-Man. We're actually going to have him this weekend. So, I didn't know when I picked these up that I was going to have him this weekend. But I thought that these were so cute. I kind of want to see the size of them. These would even be cute, you guys, if you're doing like a Spider-Man themed birthday party. Look at this. Or even like for a little gift. Oh my god, these are so stinking adorable. Like you can, I was gonna say you can use them for um, goodie bags. You know, if you're not gonna have 20 kids. Like if you're gonna have 10 kids, you've got five of these. Oh, guys, how stinking cute him walking with his little spidey bag <laughs> so yes i'm so excited because we're gonna have him this saturday we're, we're actually picking him up early in the morning um hold on one second yeah we're getting him early in the morning because his other grandma's birthday is this weekend and they're gonna go out to dinner so we're gonna have him like from 10 a.m to 5 p.m so i'm so excited Oh, and then SpongeBob SquarePants. So I got those. That's for Jaden as well. I picked up some of these white bees because they didn't have the huggy ones. So I got these. It brings 72 and it's the Fisher Price one. This one actually has a scent. The ones, they haven't had the scent ones. Oh, it says fragrance free, but it says aloe vera and chamomile. I don't know. It doesn't smell like anything, but that's going in the bathroom. Reynolds wrap because I needed more. And what the heck is going on with the Reynolds wrap pop, like the sheets, the pre-cut sheets? They don't bring them anymore. And I don't know how some people, I'm sorry, and I don't mean this in a rude way, but some people say that they use the Dollar Tree brand one that they have and that it works perfectly fine. 
every time I go to use it, the minute I go to take it out of the box, it's either stuck to the other one and you go to take it apart slowly and it rips. It's horrible. I end up wasting three sheets just to get one. So, yeah. Okay, sticking with the JJ theme. That's my grandson, if you did not know. Is this one? Oh, I think this one is a different eyelash. I'm sorry, you guys. It's the Fluffy Long Doll Bowl, and it's from the Melrose Collection. So that one is different. <laughs> okay, so sticking with JJ, I got him these. He has the truck one, the dump truck, and this one is the police and the fire fighters, the fire truck. So I thought that these were so cute for him to play with. I have a whole little bin for him to play with, like his toys and everything. Um, okay, I picked this up. My store had not had these in a while. They had all the different ones. Now the reason I got this is because every time we're in the car and I put my purse in the car, it either hits like the dashboard, like when I'm coming in and out, or it scratches something so or like my hubby hears the chain and he thinks that i dropped something outside the car so i'm like no it's my purse so i got this so that i can put it and hang my purse in the car that way we don't have that issue anymore so that's what that's for <laughs> then i got these garbage bags this is the Pro protecto recycle it's for 13 gallons and they're tall kitchen bags. And I got these because there's times where I just wanna throw like, I don't know, something away that you, you need to put it in a garbage bag. But it, it's too big to fit in the bag that you have in the trash because it already has garbage. And it's too small to waste one garbage bag on it, if that makes any sense. So I got these for that reason. So that when I'm picking up things that I don't want to throw in my kitchen trash bag. Oh, they smell good, you guys. I got these. And they're supposed to be, like, is it the stretchy kind? Yeah. It shows it in the picture. It's stronger and flexible. So these actually feel really good, you guys. There's bags that I've gotten at the Dollar Tree that rip right away. But these... If I'm not mistaken, the black bags that I got last time was from this same brand and they worked perfectly fine. So I got these. It brings nine bags, which isn't bad for $1.25. So I'm going to try these out. Okay. Then in the men's section, like I say the men's section, but it's like the hardware section. They had these gloves. They're high visibility grip. It's a three pack for $1.25. Cleaning, automobile, general maintenance, fabric, and it's touch screen. Like, what? I couldn't believe that it's touch screen and it says three packs. So, I don't know if it means that it brings three gloves or three pairs. So, that's what I wanted to check out. One, wow, you guys, it brings three pairs of gloves. That is crazy. Let's try them on. They're a large. My husband has big hands, so if, oh, these may not fit him. Yeah, no, look at the large. My hands are not tiny, but they're not that big. And it fits me perfectly. And they only had the size large, but it's touch screen, it says. So, I don't know. So got those. I thought that that was a great find, and it is not a Greenbrier product. It's distributed by Westchester Protective Gear. So yes. Hi, Tina. She's always tripping away when I'm talking to you guys when I'm recording. Okay, then I had gotten a slinky, but Jaden wanted it. I gave it to him, and he broke it. So I said, well, at least I'll show the box. So there's that. Then I found they had one in brown and I think the brown one said notes, but this just looks so chic to me. It's black, it says stuff, and the pages are all blank. 
right? Are they all blank? Yeah, they're all blank. And I just thought that this would be cute to throw in my purse with a pen. And if I ever need to jot something down or whatever, I just, I don't know. I thought it was really cute. Then you guys, you know how I've been talking about making bracelets and all of that for myself. Not to sell or anything. Um, but I saw these beads. And they're so cute to put together. And these are new in my store. I've never seen these before. I just thought that these were super cute. I just need to find like the, the threading, not the threading, but you know, like the cord that you put the beads on so that I can make some bracelets. And they had these. I don't remember if I've seen these before. They, I may have seen these, but they looked new to me that day. So I picked them up just in case. But I love these colors, especially these. This green is like, I don't know, it's calling me. It's so pretty. Like, look at that. So I'm gonna make bracelets. Then I am taking Rocky, that is the dad dog. I'm taking him to the vet next Thursday um, to get fixed. And I wasn't sure if we had like a good leash and harness for him. So I just, and we, we're going to use them anyway. So I got the harness in a small and I got it in a medium. But look at that difference. Like that's a big difference from medium to small. And then these shiz, they only had it in blue. And it's an extra large, meaning like lengthwise it's long. This was the only one they had, so that's the one I got. Then I found this book. And I am, I'm sending this to a friend. I don't even want to say why, because it's just, let's just say that the book is beautiful, okay? That's all I'm going to say, because I want it to be a surprise. Okay, sorry. I Maybe when she receives it, she'll probably uh, show you guys. <laughs> okay, so guys what look at how beautiful they even put like this little detail oh my goodness this is gonna go like probably on my little fireplace thing I'm gonna next to my pictures and stuff but you see like this one is different than this one they're just so beautiful this was like with all like the spring decor mother's day type of stuff so I picked those two up then we know that they always do the little birds and they're so cute. So I picked one up for my mom and one for my grandma. I had gotten a green one. It was the only green one that they had. And guys, they broke in the bag. But I've already displayed my um, purple ones on my, I'm like looking over there because that's where my little fireplace thingy is. So mine are already displayed. And then last but not least, I was only able to find one, but look at how beautiful this is you guys oh my goodness my nail looks so bad guys so bad <laughs> it was a whole thing my nail ripped off so my nail lady is like helping it grow back and stuff and it's just a whole thing i have like a med medication on it right now so that's why it looks gross i'm sorry <laughs> but anyway look at how beautiful this is you can put a tea light in here you could leave it just as is i just found this to be so cute and then before i forget give me one second i gotta get the things that i have here to show you guys hey move rocky be careful i'm coming i'm coming back okay sorry i had them in like separate bags because i didn't want them to break like the bird did okay so I found these and I was like, what? They look like cups, cause I have cups like this that I ordered from Amazon. But they had them, did I just get two? I don't remember guys, hold on. Yeah, I did, okay, so I only got two of them. They had them in different sizes so you can display them as like, I guess, candle holders. It doesn't even say what it's supposed to be on the label. Oh, it does say candle holder. Yes, yeah, so I'm not going crazy. See, it says it right there, candle holder. And 
And I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's like that iridescent type of color. I just found them to be so cute. I might just put tea lights in here and like have them like that. I don't know. I still have to like think about it and see exactly what I'm gonna do with them, but that's that. And then last but not least, I saw this and I wanted to get this for my son's teachers. So this says, needless to say, you are an amazing teacher. And it looks like a little candy dish. So I thought that this was really cute. So I'm going to give this to them. I don't know if I'm going to put maybe some candy. And then maybe like a little gift card for like Dunkin' or Starbucks. Because my son had some issues with school in terms of his assignments, this marking period. And his teachers have been nothing but amazing in allowing him to submit his work late. You know, they're working more uh, because obviously they have to go back and grade. Hey, stop, Rocky. They have to go back and grade his work. And you know, like after they've already graded certain assignments. So I just wanted to, um, oh, and they've been coming to school earlier to work with him um, and staying after school to also work with him. So it's, just, it's been a journey. So with that being said, I wanted to give them something as like a little thank you. I do have to go tomorrow to the Dollar Tree to get something that my daughter asked me to get. And I have to get gift bags because I forgot to get that for the teachers. But yeah, you guys, that's it. That is my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Si estás aquí de chismosa and you have not yet subscribed, girl, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and join La Familia. We have lots of fun over here. Okay, I love you guys. I hope you guys are doing well. Please don't forget to leave me a comment down below. I love interacting with you guys and getting to know you. Hit that like button because that helps me out so much. It helps kind of tell YouTube, hey, yo, I like her content. Let's push it out there. You know, you know, you know. And do that for all the creators that you like, guys. Every creator that you like, if you like watching their videos, leave a comment hit the like button it just helps us so much you wouldn't even know unless you do this you know what i mean because some of us like me don't get paid to do this i don't i do this for fun so you know but anyway love you guys take care i hope you are all doing well and staying safe out there and i will see you guys again very soon bye amigas